at a 17th century book. This is a beautiful, really beautiful period, 17th century binding. Look at the nice, rich gilt ornamentation, the raised bands. It's interesting if you really look at this, how, how subtly different 17th century books are from 18th century. There's a tiny little chip here, the headband is exposed here, the edges of the text block have been speckled, and they are, uh, the boards have been gilt uh, decorated. It's worn away at the base, but you can still see quite a bit of it at the top and the sides. The book itself remains clean, tight, and sound. Nice title page, uh, printed in Paris with a decorative initial ornamentation. Uh, it is 1686, and it's got small little woodcuts, like so. Little ornamentation. Nice little chapter tailpiece there. Chapter heading here with an ornate initial there. All on beautiful <clears throat> handmade paper of the era, as typical. Nice wide margins. Uh, a lot of attention and thought was paid to typesetting at this time to make for attractive books. There's a refinement going on here, an aesthetic refinement. Yeah, nice. <laughs> Socrates. <laughs> oh, yeah, comparison of the philosophy of men of the world. <laughs> Interesting. And... So this beautiful book is now available online from me, Brian DeMambro.